Here we are. Look spiffy, you look I am really spiffy today. <laughs> you are. <laughs> and show 213. Is this all right? What's today? Must be 14. 214? Yeah. Okay. Well, it's a, it's yeah. not a 5. It's not a five. And it's not a three. Yes, it's it must be a, be a four. four. Welcome to Philly Real Fun, episode two, one, four. Or over. a nine. A four or a nine, because yeah. it's a Thursday. Right, definitely not a nine. Hello, Heidi. Good morning, Heidi. How are you? <laughs> Welcome to today's show. It's a very special show. It's a very special because show. Because today, Twenty becomes an Australian. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> That's his Australian Bush Rangers hat. That's right. <laughs> Hi, yes. Good morning, Bob. <laughs> Heidi. Yes, we will see you shortly. And Heidi. Vicky. Taisha. Very ah. smart. Yes, ah, very smart. I am very spiffy. <laughs> Should have put on the dark jacket because that's really bright. Uh, oh, I see what yeah, you mean. Yeah, for the show. Yes. Well, that's actually, right. I can do something about that. Well, well, she, she's she's, am, she's amazing, isn't she? So, Heidi is here, Bruce has joined, Cindy has joined as well. Yasmin Woot Woot in a dressing gown today, that's right. Yeah, this is one of those really weird, crazy Wednesdays on Thursdays where I can't dress insane, right? Because we normally dress <coughs> insane at the dark park on crazy Wednesdays on Thursdays. That's right, and because feel 20's feeling a bit bright, and because it's a really special day, oh my God, and because he's this. wearing his Australian <laughs> Bush Rangers hat. <laughs> uh, I bet you it's a magpie. We got him thing. a present. It's a magpie. <laughs> There's a oh, little wow. note in there right. to say who it's from. <laughs> Congratulations, baby, you're an Aussie. We love you, Mom Emmett and Bruce. That's yes. right. That's Mama, Mama, Mama. <laughs> Mama and Bruce. <laughs> Is it an outfit? Is it an outfit? Well, it's wrapped up in. We got an Australian flag. Yes. <laughs> we could almost hang it up here. Oh well. <laughs> this is one of those <laughs> raincoat things. Well, oh, these are spicy. Wow. Yes. So what I got him was a moleskin jacket because only Australians can wear a moleskin jacket. And, and my father. It's like a real bush rangers. All right, this is jackaroo good. jacket. What if I could wear it today? Uh, see if it fits in the dress code. It maybe. Oh, is there a dress code? I have no idea. Oh. <laughs> Yasmin, look it up. But so. what it says for <laughs> is the dog park, so he can go down in winter. They don't oh, get wet. Nice. It's really nice. Mm. And uh, he's an Aussie. Thank you, darling. Nearly. Uh, a couple hours, two hours. That's two right. hours. Okay. All right, so for today's I show, I yeah, believe it on. That's good. It looks like Indiana Jones. Yeah. Right. Dr. Jones. <laughs> Amber, thank you. Heidi. Okay. Cindy, yay, Kim. Australia Day 2 as well, that's right. Yes. Uh, Australia so. Day. There's our flag. <laughs> <laughs> this is good fun. Something like that. It's I got all the Southern Cross stars. <laughs> That's right. I know one constellation. All right, back it back up north. I used to know them all, yeah, <laughs> but uh, here I don't know any, which is excellent. I love seeing stars instead of constellations. Now, yeah. Bruce wants one. One what? You want an I Aussie? want one. <laughs> <laughs> there, there's a lot down here that Aussie women are nice. So. <laughs> I got yeah. the best one though. So, <laughs> oh. all right, Jack Bullen. Yay! All right, so. <clears throat> Uh, we've got a Neville Goddard quote, courtesy of Bonnie Donaldson. I'm still bright. Look how bright I am. God, I'm so bright today. <laughs> you look like you're in a straight jacket. That's right. <laughs> Guys, leave it. Uh, Neville Goddard quote, timeless wisdom of the ages, all that good stuff. And uh, <laughs> loving, uh, loving <laughs> Victoria's enthusiasm, says Heidi. That's yeah. right. So... Ah, shall we dive into the quote today, Hello, Bruce? Pussy boy, you Morning, need Bruce. to get off. All right, you need to ready, 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 ready. Okay, cheese. <gasps> Yay, guys! All right, so Stella Jim has joined. Hello, Stella Jim. Right. Oh, now we noticed a question you had yesterday, and then I That's forgot right. to copy it up. Cool, Stella Jim, ask your question again. I think it was about yeah. time. Was it about the amount of time to feel it real? Stay to oh, stay to like sleep and the toolbox. Yeah, how cool. much time? Excellent. That's right, something as, like that. As much as it takes, but I, I'd say the number one problem people do is they go, right, so I'm going to spend uh, 10 minutes getting into the state of king to sleep, or they skip it entirely. Yes. When I, you know, uh, draw, learn to drop in fast. Yeah. Uh, second thing is they'll do, instead of a scene, they'll do a script. Mm. So, yeah, scene defined as in, uh, 
Yeah, I'm at the voting place already. I'm not driving to the voting place in the car, listening to the thing. We don't have a radio. Uh, we finally get to the voting place, and there's people there in line. There's a little girl in front of me. It, none of that stuff. It's called, right, here's my name. Give me my ballot. Thank you. Mm. Time to go. Right? Mm. So, bang, there's the mm. scene. That fast. Yeah. Also, I reckon it's like, um, it's not so much how much time to devote per thing in a day, like, oh, I'll do my 10-minute session in the morning and 10-minute session in the afternoon. It's like um, I find it really useful as we bump up against something during the day. So it's like um, I will often, for example, bump up against something if I'm with my mother. <laughs> <laughs> so Anybody gets that? anything that comes out like that I don't, not that I don't want to hear, but if there's something that she's saying that's like, that doesn't fit what I'm feeling right now. By the way, this is like, going to fit into the today's quote. This is, is cool. it? And she oh, doesn't cool. even know what it is. So. No. So I instantly go, I remember when it was, you know, and all revising, I'm hearing this instead of yep, what right was she said in the past. So it's like all straight, straight away, yep. it becomes something I'm hearing in the present moment. Yep. There's like yeah. two skill sets. <laughs> I mean, there really is something like when, when I was up and coming doing the karate thing i mean i did my basics every day basics 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 yeah yeah you know, stretching kicking all that good stuff and today uh, i mean as a martial artist what do i do every day i do my basics like every Standing day every basis. day every yeah. day every day mm -hmm. i mean just my basic basics yeah. uh still every day and then there's the constant play mm. yeah, and the constant play like victoria said if mom calls you know cool yeah. let's change it yeah you know, just lift her out of the gutter you know yeah. just uh boom so uh yeah. cool how quickly can you fill a pinprick that quickly? That's right. <laughs> now, Bonnie says, please take pictures of the swearing-in ceremony. Cool. I'm oh. sure somebody will. Okay. I'll try and um, oh, yeah, I'll take Maxwell. my iPad or something. Yeah, we've got yeah. all, well, all sorts of <coughs> Maxwells <coughs> there as well. We've got lots of yeah, gadgets too. That's right. <laughs> lots of Maxwells, lots of gadgets. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> so, <coughs> all right. That does not mean a Maxwell is a gadget. No. <laughs> But was that inductive or deductive or confused ductive uh, thoughts or things, and it's all the same anyway, logic. So, Victoria. Yes. Shall uh, we, we read shall the dive in. Yes. That's right. Let's, let's read do it. Bonnie's quotes. All right. So, there it is, right there. There is a quality of denial that protects man from receiving impressions that are, that are not in harmony with his nature. He adopts an attitude of total indifference to all suggestions that are foreign to that which he desires to express. Discipline denial is not a fight or a struggle, but total indifference. Mm. All right. So, during this whole up to the citizenship thing, which has been going on for essentially, we'll just say like uh, six years, time. right? <laughs> Feels so, like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. So, so th there have been reports in the news, you know, immigration policies are going to be changed and made more strict based upon something that happened because some guy did something bad someplace in Australia. Yes. Uh, and of course, we don't watch the news or pay attention to it, but guess what? Yeah. It shows up anyway, right? Yeah. And so when stuff like that shows up, I'm not going to sit there and go, uh, I love myself or I've got mushrooms for a brain or whatever. I, I'm, I'm not going to uh, cancel, cancel, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Complete indifference. That doesn't matter. Just really getting that doesn't matter. That's mm. uh, what, what, what's your mom saying? Doesn't matter. No. Right, just uh, a man. Yeah, I really like how he says um, that are foreign to that which you desire to express or whatever. Like yep. It's just like, no, that doesn't fit. It's, yeah. it's foreign. So, yeah, it bears no relevance. Like, yeah, to I, me. I like watching, since you brought up your mom, I like watching her mom run out because we'll lift her mom from the gutter and uh, <laughs> she'll run out of crap. <laughs> and see, because other people go, oh, money, that's terrible. Something else. Well, what about this? What could you have done? What do you think? Yeah, and and and, and she'll run out with me. And she'll run out with her, and it's like, hmm. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm out of crap to say. Yeah, no kidding. You know, we we've lifted you out of the gutter, right? Yeah, that's blah when she blah blah. It's that's time right. to go home. <laughs> yeah, but when she runs out of stuff to yeah. to, to to grumble about, uh, she's an angel. 
and she's mm. a fantastic gardener. She's got a gift. She's, yeah. So, so we just, all right, you know, I'm just imagining her as a gorgeous gardener. You know, blah, 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 blah. And at some point it runs out, and the gorgeous gardener shows up, and I go, score. Mm. So, mm. that complete indifference. It, it, it's funny, Bonnie would send this to, to us today. She, she, but Bonnie usually posts a quote. Right? And I have no idea what it is, right? So I just go in, see her name, approve it, bang, and then we're, then we're off to the races. Uh, she took a few moments today, for some reason, right, to say, hey, this will make a good show. Yeah. And I'm thinking, right, well, we're going to talk about the uh, citizenship thing and some other stuff. But when I read the quote, it's like, oh, I know this quote. This is good. This fits today. Because at any time over the past couple of years, if I didn't have disciplined denial, yeah. you know, the news could have bumped me out of my state. Yeah. And it, but instead, I'm going, watch me. Yeah. <laughs> Get it? Yeah. Just, just boom, right? Mm. So, Peter Rundle has joined <clears> as <throat> well. Who, uh, yep, <laughs> two hours, buddy. Heading out yeah. after the show. Yeah. Uh, that's right. Yeah. So, how, how are we doing? Questions, comments, thoughts? Toss them up. Because, uh, uh, obviously, it's 8, 12 in the morning here. And uh, I don't got much to talk about today. I'm just, like, uh, <laughs> in the zone. He calls it a duality of denial. What do you see? The the quality? Is that oh I'm done quality. Oh quality. Yeah, Sorry. The quality of denial. All right. Yes. Yeah. Now what I love here with this uh, is it is not a fight or a struggle, but total indifference. Yeah. Right? So so uh, yeah. you don't gotta fight Trump or Obama or Hillary or Yeah. Yeah, the news, or the new policy, or the old policy. Yeah. Complete indifference. When you get, and, and here's the thing, you know, I, I just posted three words up right before I came out the door. Buy the pearl. Yeah. If you don't buy the pearl, oh my God, there's a lunatic in the White House. That's going to hurt you. I, I, yeah. I, and I'm saying that in love. I don't like it when people hurt <laughs> themselves. You know, if, you, if you're jamming a, 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 a syringe in your arm, and I don't like that. Okay, if, if Definitely, you're, because it, we were also saying on a, a, a show off. a week or so ago about... Off. Off, good boy. Um, a week or so ago about if there's a fight or a struggle, look what you're imagining. Absolutely. Because you're feeling that fight and struggle. So, it's yes, to come from um, indifference, it, there's nothing. It's just a wash, do you know what I mean? Like totally, absolutely. There's nothing grabbing it at whatever it is mm -hmm. and making it in, mean something and feel something so yeah yeah no secondary cause yeah. well you, you can't get wound up about what doesn't matter mm -hmm. in manifesting master we talk about three states of matter anybody remember this vincent bruce taisha uh is the link to the quote in the group uh yeah but you, if you do a quick search for bonnie donaldson in the group you'll see the the quote i don't have that lecture up on freenevel.com shame on me i'll get it up maybe tomorrow it's called so, the Twelve Disciples, it looks like. It's yep. come from a lecture from Neville. So mm -hmm. so what's really cool with this, I think it's in one of the books as well, uh, but mm. I didn't have time to look it all up. So if you really get this, this whole thing of uh, the, the more you give up secondary cause, again, at some point it just becomes ridiculous because, you know, it's not the puppies that make me happy. I enjoy them, okay? You know, yeah. But they can't make me happy. Because we all know people with puppies that aren't happy. You know people that are married that aren't happy. And they go, yeah. yep, you make me mad. Yeah. And we go, well, no, you're supposed to make me happy. Instead of just yeah. going, you know what? <laughs> I enjoy your company. I love you. You know, it's great to share this adventure of a lifetime with you. Yeah. 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 Want some wine? Chocolate? <laughs> <laughs> wine and chocolate? Chocolate flavored orange. Cherries, wine. chocolate, orange. Exactly. So, Taisha, thanks. Taisha says, oh my God, I saw that lecture today while searching for eternal states. Cool. Mm. I, you know, yeah, I, I was looking at eternal states for some reason <coughs> today as well. Bruce Rupp, he wins. Matter. Antimatter and doesn't matter. We've shared yeah, that yes. in Manifesting to the Max. Thanks, Bruce. Very I lost that good, loop. Bruce. So there are three states of matter in the world. There's matter, what matters. Yeah. Okay. What you hold in mind tends to manifest, right? What you feel becomes real. That matters. There's antimatter. Antimatter is the echo. Right? What matters is what you feel becomes real. We feel puppy parents, and then there's antimatter. Yep. Those don't cause anything. Those just showed up. Right? 
And then there's doesn't matter. And again, this is the way I'm playing with it today. Doesn't matter is Trump's in office. Who cares? Yeah. He's not going to affect me or my puppies or my sweetheart or my iPad. or. And you know what? And if I think he does, I did that. Yeah. 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 Coolamundo. Mm. So, doesn't matter Bill's it's not, not finding that lecture on the site. It's elsewhere on Google, though. Yep. We'll put it up on the site. We'll yeah. get it there. So, Bill, we've got to talk. <laughs> we have to have the conversation. Talk. That's right. It's like okay. we're an old married couple, Bill. We have to talk. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, based on your comment you shot me the other day, let's, let's hook up. So, all right. Not as in that way, but as in that way. So, anyway, right. Okay, that's it. I think we're going to go. Yeah. You guys are going to have to survive for a couple hours. So. Who who was it that was it Naji that wanted the photo of that? Oh Nadi. Nadi? Yep. Is she it's, here? She's uh, not here. I didn't see her today yet. But uh, we got a special photo coming for you. Yeah, I was just thinking if we just turn the camera in case she watches it so can, just to say, oh. look, they're coming and when they're like really special and open, we'll uh, yeah, take some goodie photos. All right, so we'll do that with the closing. Visit us at freenovel.com. Yeah. Over 1,000 goodies, except for today's lecture. <laughs> <laughs> Which so so, become, so that yeah, means there'll be 1,001, 1001, right? Over 1,001. Over 1,001. <laughs> I'll put that in there. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so I had some guy actually email me one day about that. He says, 1,000. <laughs> yeah, read. <laughs> I'm sorry, I got an official count thing. I can see how many posts are on my website, right? Yeah. So, anyway, uh, freenovel.com, doing some manifesting mastery because it's good fun, great yeah. fun, and that's where most of the success stories come from. And you can learn about matter, antimatter, and it doesn't matter in a different way that we shared in there. So, and for the refunds, Victoria, go to feelitrealfun.com. That's right. All right, so we're going to show we'll the show. Yeah, these. this is one of my. This is probably almost my favorite plant. It's called. Um, I don't know if you can see it there. It's starting to bloom. It's a Madagascan jasmine, and it the flowers. The I don't know if we can see them here. Start popping out, and jasmine's unreal, and it's going really lovely all around the French doors. So, yeah, nutty. Shoot your link to today's show because the photos are coming. That's right. <laughs> I'll we'll get one today. We'll see how the yeah, see how, how they open up. up. Okay. All right. Love you guys. Have a wonderful day. There's the camera. There's Victoria. <laughs> yeah. Freenevel.com, guys. See ya.